Hey Roselle Club, welcome to my workout. Thanks for joining me today for a strength training workout. We'll be working three things, lower body, upper body, and your abs, your midsection. I'm going to list some equipment today, and what I'll be using is a table. You might use a chair or a couch. If you don't have either, use the floor. I've also enlisted the use of some laundry jugs filled with water. And I'll be using a bag as a prop. And I have my water, of course. You should too. Please make sure to take all the breaks you need and that you're medically clear to participate in a workout of this nature or any workout. Make this workout yours and give it your best. Let's get started. For the workout today, there are three different rounds. Each round, once you start, you don't stop. You cycle through four to six exercises between 15 and 20 reps each. For example, the first set has squats, some shoulder work, bicep curls, and then some ab work with rotation. You do 20 reps of each, and we go through that three times non-stop. Of course, you can stop and take breaks along the way, but jump back in whenever you're ready and give it your best. All right, let's warm up. Some rotation. It's important here not just to keep the arms loose, but see if you can reach around the corner a little further and look over your back shoulder. Soften the knees, flatten the feet, a little pendulum, tick-tock, lateral flexion. Wake up those lateral flexors that support your spine. Let's make it bigger and go into a circle all the way around. Come towards me and then stand up tall, slightly lean back, open the chest, go the other way. One more time each way. We're gonna head into our first squat. Nice long neutral spine. And when you stand up again, drive the shoulders back and lift the chest. Let's do that again. Let's just get into the squats now. We're gonna do about six more, but let's add the heel lift. Get those ankles in the game. Wake up those calves. Three, last two. I'd like you to hold it down at the bottom. Hold it. Not long, just for five, four, three, two. Up, down again. I know you didn't expect that. Five, four, open the chest. Three, reach back. Two, and one. Well done. One foot forward, the other leg back, go into some lunges. Touching down. You can add just a little bit of balance and a little bit of rotation. I want the back foot to come off the floor and balance on your front leg. Let's do that now. Hold it up and lunge. Hold it up and again. Nicely done. Down and stay. Open up that space between your knees left to right to make sure you're balanced. Arms like a wing across your chest. Turn towards the leg that's in front and then come back to center. Turn the other way. Now if you look down, the knees should not have moved in. They should stay out right where they started. Let's go back to center and stand up. Switch legs, nicely done. Just some active lunges. Let your arms move naturally. If you feel good holding them here, great. If you wanna let them move like in a runner, that's great too. Just a couple more, we're gonna put the balance in. Ready? Lift up that back leg. Hold. And four. Three to go. Two to go. No, you held it. Don't be ready to fall back. I'm going to test you. Stay here now. Stay here. And down and hold. Make sure you've got that space balance between left and right leg. So when you're here, you don't feel like you're on a balance beam. Hands across the chest. Rotate towards the leg that's in front of you without letting either knee move. Come back towards the other way. Back to center and up you go. Good job, check those legs out. Okay, you know we'll be using those arms, so we have to do some push-ups. I would ask that even though you can do these on your toes, since this is just your warm-up, do them on your knees anyway. I don't care if you're the biggest linebacker, for the smallest person just getting started. Make sure we introduce work to the shoulders gently and gradually so that they don't get a shock to what we're going to do more of later. 
Let's give him a bit of a warm up. So staying on my knees, knees down. Just gonna do six more. Six, five, four. And now let's head into our first plank. Now planks, people think are very uh, passive, and they are, but they're also very active. But we can make them more active by lifting a leg, walk those feet out, alternate the lift, four, three, two, one, maybe a little bit of a body bounce, hold it, and knees go down. Good job. Okay, our first set. Squats, lateral shoulder raises using our smaller weights. Bicep curls, we're gonna use our bag for that and then get into some Russian twists. Let's get started in our first set. Remember, three rounds through, 20 reps each and we don't stop. I'm gonna be picking up the big jug for 20 reps. Here we go. That's one, two, now you keep me honest because you know, I might say 12 when really there's only six. I'd say that's halfway. You can lift those heels and get those ankles in the game. Seven, six, four. Last one, okay. Pick up those lighter weights, lateral shoulder. Soft the knees and lift directly to the side. Let's make sure we don't end up like we're flapping wings too high. Shoulder height is just fine. Soften the knees. Now, if you think you can go a little bit faster and not lose any good form, then you should. If you need to go a little bit slower and get really good quality, then you should do that as well. Five, four, three, two. Now watch this, last one. I'm putting these inside the bag. Bicep curls. One, two. I think next time I'm gonna have to put that heavy weight in here because I think I'm holding out and this one's a little bit light. How about you? Halfway. Woo! Last five. Okay, maybe I won't use that heavy one. <laughs> Three, two, one. All right, Russian twists. Now, a lot of times people have their feet elevated. I would like your feet grounded so you can really work on the rotation. Neutral posture, hands like we did in the warm-up for those lunges where they're across your chest like a wing. Keep your nose over your hands and turn the whole rib cage, not just your head, and side to side. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, oh boy, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, what's next? We're gonna jump back up and get right back into those squats. 19, 20, up you go. Whew. And one, two, three, four, five, six. Get those ankles in. Seven, eight, nine, 10, Whew. 13, 14. Woo! Hope you're still with me. Just a few more. Last one, all right. Lateral shoulder. Here we go. One, two, three. Oh, there's a nice breeze I feel. I don't know about you, but doing this outside, it's nice when that breeze kicks up. Are we halfway? Did someone say yes? Okay, I'll believe you. Nine, eight. Maybe I should have made these half full. Four, three, two. Now let's make sure I've got my bag close by. And like I said, next time I would use the heavy one, so I'm gonna keep my word. Heavy one in there. Oh boy, let's go. One, two, three. So now next time you go to the grocery store and they offer you one of these bags, you're gonna say yes. Halfway. Nine. You can comment 
Anytime, if you think I held out, or if I didn't count right, I will believe you. Four, three, two, oh my gosh. Russian twists, here we go. This is round two, yes? Proud posture, one. Thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, a little lower, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Last set, let's go. Up, up. No breaks unless you really need them. Woo! I'm gonna show you a little bit of extra on this one. I hope you can join me. One, I'm gonna increase my speed. Three, and I'm gonna lift my heels. And for the last two, I'm actually gonna leave the floor, but you don't have to. You can just keep lifting your heels. Nine, halfway, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, let's go, loop hop, land soft and strong, keep your chest up, last four, three, two, one, oh my gosh, <sighs> lateral shoulders, <sighs> nothing fancy here, one, two, option, you could get a little fancy, ready, just for five reps, Five, four, three, two, smiling always makes it easier. Both feet down. Five, four, three, two, ready, and you are. Oh boy, five. I'm squinting, but you can't tell, but I am. Three, two, oh boy, one, little wobble on that one. Bicep curls, oh my gosh. Last set. Ah, one, two, three, four, five, six. Careful not to let the weight yank you forward. You should be balanced with your body weight from the middle to the front of your foot, not your heels. Someone tell me I've only got five left, please. All right, let's go. Five. A little slower on the way down, four. Okay, slow on the way down. Three, and two, and. Ready, hold it, hold it, hold it, let it go. Last set of Russian twists, here we go. Get a little recovery after this, come on. One, two, three, four, five. Wanna make this harder? Reach out. Uh, but keep your head between your arms and your arms don't move beyond your shoulder width. 10, 9, 8, 7, oh, I'm going back. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh my gosh. How did you do? Woo! Round one done. Two more to go. Cheers. While you sit in the recovery, or you grab your water, I'm gonna show you the next set. Here we go. Now because we're doing lunges, and I said we'll be doing between 15 and 20, the total reps we'll be doing is 30, but it's 15 on each leg. You can do them with just your body weight. You can hold a weight. You can hold two weights, or you can do what I'm going to do. I'm going to circle the weight under my leg. And I'm gonna do that 15 times on each leg, and then we're gonna to go to the next exercises, which is basically a shoulder press. But here's the fancy thing we're gonna to do today. You're gonna to sit on your chair, or you can sit on the floor, and do your shoulder press with nice posture, or option to lift one leg or two. We call that a twofer, two for one. And that'll be your second exercise, shoulder press with a V-sit. The V-sit's optional. Your tricep exercise will be on the chair or the table. Be very, very sure, folks, to not let this happen. Don't let your tailbone tuck out. Tuck it in with nice neutral spine and don't go so low that you feel your shoulders have to shrug. Keep those shoulders down and back and like the turtle coming out of its shell. And then the next, the last one we'll be doing is your knee pull for your abs. So, out, in, 
out, in. I think you've had enough recovery. Let's get started. Lunges. Ready? Now, I'm not gonna coach much, I'm just gonna count because I wanna make sure we get the numbers right. Good balance stance. You can sort of see your tiptoe in front of your knee and don't lean forward. Stay more up tall than forward. Starting in the front of the leg, inside of the leg and going around to the outside of your body. Here we go. One, two, three. Notice I'm not leaning side to side to change hands. The arms can move, but the body doesn't. Got stuck. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, oh my gosh, 15. Woo! Round two. One, Feeling some heat. Last five, come on. Are you going to sit on the floor or sit on the chair for your V sit shoulder press? Are you going to do the V sit or are you just going to do the shoulders? Here we go. I'm going to do just the shoulders today and I'll do the V sit in the next round. Here we go. One. How many reps? 20. Posture, posture, folks. Eleven, twelve, almost there. Thirteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. And done. Woo! Now, tricep dips. Here we go. On the edge of the table or the chair. Push your tailbone back. Nice, strong, neutral spine. And don't let the shoulder shrug. One, two. Now we can bounce and go fast, but then you won't get as much out of this. So let's work a consistent speed. Seven, eight, nine. Ensure your shoulders are not squeezing too tight behind you and your elbows are pointing not sideways, but backwards. Let's go. Let's call it five more to go. Five, four, three, two, and up you go. Now you can do that knee pull here, or you can do it on the floor. Let's go. And one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven, eight, nine. Hold this one, hold it, and let's go. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Can you go lower? 16, 17, 18, 19. Up you go. Lunges. We start on that side. Let's start on this side for this leg. Here we go. Starting in front of the leg on the inside, going around to the outside. Good balance. Let's start. One. Constant speed if you can. Of course, smiling always makes things better. Where's our breeze I was talking about? Like, oh, there we go. All you have to do is ask. Five, four, three, two, one. No rush. Balance first, set yourself up, and let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, 
six. Two, last one, get a little lower if you can. Oh. All right. I promise you the V-sit. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Now if these jugs are on the inside, it's a little easier. If I flip that weight outside, it gets a little bit more challenging. Halfway. Nine. Eight. Seven. A little behind me and my abs have to work harder. Six, five, posture, four, three, two, one. Whose idea was that? Here's another option. Tricep dips, a little weight in your lap. One, two, three, four. Option. Ten more. I'm not going to be a fan of the number 20 after today. Four, three, two, one. Woo! Ab pull. See if you can lean back a little further on this one. And one, two. Am I allowed to do this? Seven. Woo. Nine. Ten. Halfway. Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. When you get here, posture. Come on. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Oh. Let's go. What's next? You know what your favorite? Lunges. All right, facing you this time. 15 reps each leg. One, two, three. Now for five of these reps, I'm gonna let my back knee touch the floor. That's five. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Five more, keep going. Now this is your last set, right? Two. So ready? Remember what we did in the warm-up? Take your back leg off the floor and balance. Last round's gonna be tough. We're gonna have to really push through because it's the longest one. Let's see if we can get those five last ones here. Four, touch the floor. Three, two, oh my goodness. Shoulder press. Weights on the outside, here we go. One, one leg up or two, you choose or none. Three, four. Want to make it harder? Go a little wider. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now your shoulders know what to do, so think of the posture. 13, 14. Do you remember what's next? What are the two things you're gonna make sure you do during those tricep dips? Last rep here. Posture your back and don't go too low. Position, let's go. You count. What's next? Your favorite ab work. Posture, let's go. One, two, three, four, five. 
You know I'm gonna throw something extra in because this is your last round of this set. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 15, 16, 17, 18. Ready? Hold it open. Hold, 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 hold. Five, four, three, two. Oh my goodness. You have earned your water. Woo. Towel down. Two rounds down, one to go. Now I know what you're thinking. You're thinking he hasn't done any push-ups yet. Well, that's okay. I didn't forget. And they're in this set. We'll be doing push-ups, tricep kickbacks, some bridging, biceps, again. We're gonna do some abs, and then some rear delt fly. So if you think of those exercises the way they work, you're down for push-ups, standing up for the kickbacks. Down for the bridging, standing up for the biceps. Down for your abs, and back up for your rear delt fly. So the functional aspect here is up, down, up, down, or down, up. You're always getting up and getting back down, and we're not gonna stop. Woo, my breath take is still up. How about another 30 seconds? No, you ready to go? Man, you guys are a tough group. Okay, let's get ready for those push-ups. Making sure your head doesn't thrust forward, and your spine doesn't go too low. You can do this on your knees or on your toes or on one foot, you can do Spider-Man push-ups, whatever you want, your best 20. We're running out of time, we've got to move quick. I'm going to do the first set on my knees. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven. Have you fun yet? Six, five, four, Two, one, up we go. Tricep kickbacks. You get your light weights, your soup cans, your bottles of water, your detergent jugs like I have. Neutral posture, head above the heart, elbows to rib cage, reach back without swinging up. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine. Woo! Last five. Three, two. All right, lying down on your back. And your feet flat, and you're gonna you're going to lift your glutes, making sure not to force your head back or to let your knees flare out. All right, your feet shouldn't be too close to your bum. They should be a little bit out in front of your shins for this set. Here we go. Breathe in, exhale, and lift. Squeeze your glutes tight. Don't let those knees flare. And let's go. Two. Squeeze the glutes. Three. Four. Option. Six. Your head is light, not forcing itself back. Nine. Ten. Squeeze. Last few, 17, nicely done. Last one, give it a good squeeze. And we're down, so now you know we have to get up. Bicep curls, it's all ready. One, two, oh, whose idea was it to put the big jug in the bag? lying on your back with your hands behind your ears. We're going to do the bicycle with rotation, but making sure your hands are not like this and they're not yanking on your head. 
I'm gonna add a little roll up, so watch me for the first time and then join me for the rest. Hold here, slow rotations. One, notice I'm turning my whole torso, not my elbows. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Hold it, put your feet down, roll up. Posture and roll down slow. Do that again, roll up and roll down slow. And finish your last 10. 10, nine, eight, seven. Slow and strong. Six, five, four, three, two, one. You're gonna grab those light weights and can do your shoulders and the rear delts. Here we go. Tip from the hip, soft knees, and the arms go directly to the side. I'm not looking for a big bend. I would like more of a straight arm without going above your body. Five, six, eight, nine. Halfway. Notice I'm looking down because I don't need to see this in the mirror. I need to feel it in my body. Last few. exercise for a push back now we're gonna push into the floor and do those push-ups here we go big set on your toes if you can let's go one two three four, six if you like to make this harder hip up Last one. Second exercise. You're gonna grab those light weights and do tricep kickbacks. Let's go. Two, three, four, five. Now I don't know if you're counting exercises, but there are six exercises in this set. Ten more. Ten. Nine. Eight. Are your shoulders down and back? Six, five, four, three, two, one. Bridging. We gotta move quick because we are running out of time. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nine, ten. Remember what's next? It's a really easy transition. You just gotta stand up and grab that bag. Five, four, three, two, one. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, seven, eight. Working the guns. Do you know you have less than two minutes of work left? Less. Last rep. Whoa. On your back. Abdominals. One, two, three, four. Shoulders open. Elbows back, out of your line of sight. Halfway, put those feet down, roll up. Roll down slow. Roll up. Roll down slow. Finish your last 10. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Up you go. What's next? Rear delt. Here we go. One, two, strict form, three. Notice the neck is not hanging or lifting. It's nicely aligned with the body. Halfway. Hope you didn't stop moving. You know I keep counting even though I stop moving because I know you're moving. Five, four,
Last round, folks. Can you push through? What's next? Push-ups. How many? Your best 20. Last one, best one. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Put your knees down if you have to. Halfway. Go a little deeper. Nine, eight, five, look, four, three, two, one. Try to take kickbacks. One. Squeeze. Squeeze. Don't just flop. Squeeze. Like a relay runner passing the baton to the runner coming up behind you. Reach and hold it. Reach and hold it. Eight. How many more? Five, four, three. Is that your last rep? Let's do two more. One. Hold it. Ah. Bridging. Let's go. If you'd like to try, you can do 10 on one leg and 10 on the other. I'm going to stay on two feet. Four, five, six, eight, nine. Halfway. If you need help, support with your arms. Elbows can give you a good base. Last five. Four, three. Stand up and grab that bag. Bicep curls. Last set of biceps. Last chance to work the guns. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. I just saw some sweat blow off my forehead. How about you? Halfway. Ah. Check this out. Let's go. Five, <laughs> four, three, two, one. Last set of abs. Option. Watch what I do with that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Roll up. Uh, roll down. One more time. Why not? Roll it down. That was your bonus. Finish your set. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Elbows wide. Out of your line of sight. 5, 4, 3, 2. Last exercise. Come on. Oh. Rear delt. Your body remembers most what it did last. So finish well. Finish strict. One, two, three. I think we went over 30 minutes, but man, I think it was worth it. We always get a little extra, right? Halfway. 10, nine, eight, seven. Oh my gosh. I'm not going to quit on you, so don't you quit on me. Four, three, two, one. Good job, everybody. Wow. Quick sip. Cheers. Once again, thanks for Health and Fitness for sponsoring this workout. Folks, we'll all get through this together. Stick together, stay safe. Let's cool down. It's just a little bit of rotation to return to what we did in the beginning. Nice and easy. The body likes to know it can rotate comfortably. 
these into a nice squat, but this time we're gonna roll up. Hang out and roll. Open the chest. Do that again. Open the chest. And have a seat. Grab behind both knees, fall back, open the shoulder blades, stretching your back. Sit super tall and open your chest. Hands go behind you, squeeze your shoulder blades together. Then we're gonna fall onto one side and do that quad stretch. Now we know what to do here. We want this quad to stretch, but let's make sure the shoulder is not sinking in. It's nice and strong. Just a few more seconds. You're gonna take that same foot, cross it over your opposite knee, bring that knee in, and let the foot fall down. Now wrap your hand around. Nice glute stretch. Turn into it and hug the knee a little closer. Unwrap and go to the other side for your quad stretch. Again, shoulder strong. It's always such a satisfying feeling when you started and you finished. Taking breaks along the way, fine. Doing less reps or more reps, fantastic. If you did it, we're proud of you. Take that leg across the opposite knee. And let your foot that's elevated fall to the floor. Now wrap the helmet around the leg that's closest to you and sit tall. Hug the knee in. Feels good. Gentle hamstring stretch. Try to roll your shoulder blades back, lean in like you're rowing. Keep your posture strong. Now see if you can lengthen those legs. Point your toes in towards you, point your toes away. Pointing your toes in, you feel that deeper hamstring stretch. We've got about 30 more seconds to go. Let's go on one leg. Reach in. Quick switch for the other side. We love what we do and we love that you join us. We are very blessed to have you with us today. So make sure you keep exercising. We will see you again tomorrow. Have yourself a great day.